Alright, here we go. Getting ready for the LCQ round 11 of the MX Nationals. Taking the top three from here to the A main. Alright, so let me get to the stream. We got going here. Let's edit stream info. You said the monster energy supercross tags. Saying no re saying no results found. I don't know, I'll have to I might have to look into that later and see but We're gonna have to look into it. Alright, we got Spare 599, Clapper 4545, CW Racing 212, Deke 976, the Diesel 23, TGO Smokey, James MX, and Miseo Game in here in your LCQ. Top 3 going to the A main. Everybody is ready. That 30 second board is sideways. Be on board with Spare 599. To the gate, James MX looks like he got a good jump, a little wide. <clears throat> James MX even pushed a little wide there, just came into the corner a little hot, didn't get on brakes in time. So Clapper 45 is now your leader. ACL Gaming, you guys going back and forth through the sand section here. This area is really tight. James MX going down in the sand, a little bit of a rough start to his LCQ. Your top three, Clapper 45, 45, Spare 599, and Deep 976 making the pass for second. Not wasting any time trying to get away from the crowd of riders. These guys need to get into the top three. CW Racing with, whoa, a little bit tight there. That is a crazy section. They both go down, and Deep, man, it is a bit frustrating there. Deep was up in the transfer spot, now back in seventh place trying to fight back. I'll oh, pay attention to this section. I'm sure nobody gets reset. So apparently this track has been having some issues, but it looks like oh uh, there's the problem. Okay. I'm gonna Okay, so one restart because James just got reset. If that happens again, I am just gonna run the race because I don't know. I, that glitch is really frustrating to me. I don't know if anybody's watching. If you have any opinions on what you think should be done with a glitch like that, I am gladly open to opinions because it is a bit frustrating that the game is doing that. Are you ready, Smokey? Okay. All right. So restart there. Issue. Whoa, a couple guys coming together. So top three right now D976, TKO Smokey, and James MX.
right now. Deep976, James MX, out front. He's second place. These guys almost coming together there. A bit close. TKO Smokey in the last transfer spot in third. Clapper45 coming up the inside before the double. Spare 599, CW racing on the inside. TKO Smokey off the side of the track. Slowed up there. I don't know what happened. It's just up there with Clapper. Whatever's going on, but everybody's cleaning this lap, so I think the rest of the race should be good as long as it doesn't happen the first lap. It seems to be fine for the most part. I on it. James Max, Clapper, 45, 45, still your top three. Back here, Spare 599 is in fourth, trying to chase down third and goes off the track, hitting the tough box. So your top three starting to spread out a bit. These guys just need to run it home and they should be good for the main event. Clapper, 45, holding down the final transfer. up to third to get that last transfer spot. A lot of battling going on. These guys are a tight bunch back here. Right now your top three heading down the long straight rollers off the dragon's back into the sand. It's a fun section to hit. You get fifth gear pinned and you just send it off of that into the sand. Back down the start straight. We got a minute, 17 seconds left, so about two laps to go. Lap time's a bit longer on this track than normal. Some guys getting down into the low 140s. Track is a bit technical in areas, but for the most part, pretty wide open. It's pretty simple in some, but a few different areas that can separate guys, especially this section coming up here. section of jumps. Really hard to hit because you have to be turning the bike at the same time while jumping. Let's go back, just to keep an eye on what's going on back here. These guys are still battling, man. And Top four, that would be crazy because these guys are going at it. TKO Smokey, bit of a bump on the diesel there. I think it was terribly intentional, but these guys just coming together in the corner. Don't think it was intentional, but just let them know. Just be careful, it is the LCQ though, so these guys are just trying to fight and get up there. Top three are a bit ahead, but there's still time left. Coming down the straightaway. Upper 45, putting some pressure on Deke. I'm sure both of these guys know they are in the top three, and they are in a qualifying spot, so they don't want to make anything, make any mistakes, do anything that's too risky. Your leader is James MX, heading through the sand. Rhythm here, running out front in LCQ with one lap left. Geo Smokey coming into the sand section, those guys coming down the ski jump. And that sweeping stadium bull turn. 
corner is pretty tricky though. Theo Smokey sliding out on there. Misio Gaiman battling with him. The top three have definitely separated. I think that is it for this race. Geek though with a mistake in these rollers. second place. So your winner in the LCQ, James MX, Clapper 45, coming through in second. Deep 976 in third. Clapper with a little bit of a stoppy there. A little bit of a celebration. Unfortunately just one spot out. The Diesel 23 coming through in fourth place with TKO Smokey right behind him in fifth. Spare 5, 9, 9, and 6. And CW Racing will be in 7th place. I'll round out your LCQ. So there you have it. James MX, Clap at 45, 45, and Deep 976 making it to the A main. The rest will be going to the B main event. Don't mean to ask too much of you, Smokey, but would you like to host a B main? If you got time, it's cool. If not, though, I can have somebody else do it. Okay. I appreciate it. Alright, so we'll get that updated. But we'll see if people show, because typically people have left, which I can't blame them after the B main or the LCQ. But we'll see. Yeah, I'll put put the list in, and then So I'm going to open up the lobby for the A main, and then TKO Smokey is the host of the B main. We have the Diesel 23, Spare 599, CW Racing, and MeSail Gaming in the B main. If you would like to join that, TKO Smokey will be your host.
Alright, so let's get the invites sent out for the A main. We have the lobbies updated and posted. So we're gonna have Rocky Chop, your fastest qualifier. Second place is gonna be Parker 7574. And your third fastest qualifier is Butter Dactyl. Coming in fourth for qualifying is Tiger T164. Fifth place is Healthy Pancakes. And sixth place is Top Team MX60 TTV Dirt Shark 720 was in seventh. We had one rider out, one did not show, so the next one up was Metal Jacket 91. just need a metal jacket and that'll be our full main event for the A main and then the B main riders again TKO Smokey is the host we have the Diesel 23, Spare 599, CW Racing 212 and Nisail Gaiman okay so that lobby is open for the B main You might just look in your recents because he may have been in your. Uh, you have the Diesel 23. Uh, look in your recents because of the race, they'll be in there. Uh, Spare 599, and Mesial Gaming, and CW Racing. Just waiting on one more to ready up, and we will get started into our A main motos. We got two 20 minute motos, each plus one lap. And forgot to mention on the stream, the overall winner of this race will get a free mystery box from Forever Grips. You can use the code Moto Grips at Forever Grips Gaming to save 15% on your order. Hoping for a good race, a clean race, lots of good battles, and no reset glitches. It's the only time I will say it, because if I talk about it, then it's just going to make it worse. Loading up here for round 11, the West Coast Racing Tournament's MX National Series. Points leader is Top Team MX. Second place in the points, Max Miles 150, not here for this race. So it's looking like Top Team might be your champion after tonight, so we will find out. Look at our point standings right now. Currently, top team is 38 points ahead of Max Miles 150. He would have to be at least 73 points or more after this race. So he really just needs 35 more points. I think that is doable because his lowest score is 45. All right. So here we go, Clapper 45, 45, Top Team MX, Butter Dactyl, Tiger T 164, 
LD Pancakes, Parker 75, 74, Metal Jacket 91, Deke 976, James MX 81, Rocky Chop 27, and TTV Dirt Shark 720. These guys are lined up on the gate, ready to go. 30 second board is sideways. Let's see who we are on board with. Got our top team, switcher. Oh, we got one guy. Who's next backing up, but not much of a jump on it. Deke 976 is going to get your hole shot. A lot of guys down in the first turn there. Deke 976 and James MX with a clean run into the first corner. A lot of these guys coming together in that first turn. Top team trying to make his way up there. On the inside of Butter Dactyl, the Clapper 45 trying to make his way up as well. Top team making the pass on the Clapper. A couple of guys coming together. Oh, Clapper was off the track. He just like went sideways off there. Bumped into some guys. That was really unfortunate. Deke 976 with a good hole shot. A great start out front. Coming through in the LCQ is now leading the moto here. Butter Dactyl in second place. James MX is up into third. Parker 75 in fourth. Top team and TTV Dirt Shark back here going back and forth. Metal Jacket in six. Trying to go by. These guys running into the tough box. It is crazy. Just gonna make sure all these guys get through here good. Everybody's through. Everybody's through. Okay. First section is good. Better Dactyl and Deke. Going back and forth really close, though Deke actually still up ahead, Parker 75, but you know, Butter Dactyl with the battles. James and Max right behind them, heading into this long section. Parker with a bit of a bounce, Butter Dactyl trying to carry his momentum around. And all those guys down that section good, no issues. Alright. I think Clapper may have just gone down. I think that's all that happened there. So everybody through clean the first lap, no problems with the track. It's a bit of a relief, but keep it that way. All right, so Deke, still your leader. Got to give him some coverage, man. Coming through the LCQ, and he is ripping out on that Jimmy John's KTM. Parker 7574 on the Jacklings KTM James MX. Back here in third, top team MX and fourth Butter Dackle. Fell back just a little bit. Now in fifth place. Metal Jacket 91 and 6. Rocky Chop. Back in seventh with a mistake in this rolling section here. This is a tricky section. These guys are trying to turn and jump the bike at the same time. So it's really about throttle control and not going in there too fast. Rocky Chop back in seventh place. Trying to make his way to the front. Your fastest qualifier. Not the best start, but we got 15 minutes plus a lap to go. Let's go back up front. Deke 976 pretty nice. Solid ride. Really starting to find his flow and getting the speed. Parker right behind him in second place. Top team in third, Butter Dactyl in fourth. James MX is in fifth. Metal Jack in sixth. Rocky Chop here in seventh. Those guys up ahead are really close. Rocky Chop just trying to catch up to him so he can make some moves. Go so up front. We got going on up here is so a Deke 976 back in third now. Parker is your leader. Put the way for a second just to cover the guys in the back. And now the lead has changed. Deke back in fourth place. Had a great start, was out front. Not what he's wanting to have happen, but fourth place man is still good coming from the LCQ. Still got a lot of time left, so he's just gonna find his flow his lines and try to catch back up to these guys. Top team in third. 
Utter Dactyl in second, and Parker up there in the first now. Butter Dactyl though, trying to catch up. Parker taking the inside. Butter Dactyl going around the outside. These guys kind of coming together there. Butter Dactyl still on the inside. Parker is able to hold the line off. Peek back here in fourth. Rocky Chop now up into fifth place. Rocky Chop almost underneath Deke. That could have been dangerous there if he got underneath him. Probably would have made him crash. Saved himself, kind of leans to the left a little bit. So Rocky Chop focus on again making the pass on Deke. You guys, teammates on that Jimmy Johns KTM. We've got James Max in six, Metal Jack in seventh, Healthy Pancakes in eighth, Tiger T one six four in ninth, TTV Dirt Shark back here in tenth place. Dactyl out front, your leader. Parker 75 right here in second behind him. Top team chasing these guys down. Parker a little bit too far on the inside. Gets reset on that corner. Rocky Chop making his way past deep. Deep though is not done yet. Trying to make his way back again. Deke's probably just going to try to lock on to the back of Rocky here and see if he can fall him through these guys. See what lines he's hitting, what got him that fastest qualifying time of a 140. Rocky Chop catching these guys in this rolling section here. This is very tricky. Any mistake and it can really slow you up. He hits it pretty good. It really closes up some time on your top three. Deke looks like he made a mistake in that section. James MX passes him for fifth, so Deke now back in sixth. Not the race he's hoping for, but still a good start. Running in sixth place, you can't complain about that after being in the LCQ. Middle Jack is in seventh. Healthy Pancakes back here in eighth. Tiger T, 164, back in ninth place. Track is technical, man. Jumps like that can just really separate you if you don't hit it. So it's just about being consistent, hitting your lines. It really separates the guys if you don't make a jump on most tracks, but these one, this one is pretty tricky for them. Let's go up front. I see some guys switching around. Top team in fourth. Butter Dactyls in third. Rocky Chop here in second. Rocky Chop making his way up to the front. Parker must have made his way around Butter Dactyl because Butter Dactyl was your leader for a bit. These guys are just going back and forth. It's really difficult to keep track of where everybody is at. Different leader in each section. It seems like one person makes a mistake, the other one makes the pass. Rocky Chop getting into the lead. He's back in the back of the pack at the beginning of the race now. Making his way up to the front. Butter Dactyl kind of running into the back of Parker a little bit. Incidental contact, obviously not trying to run into him. Top team is back here in fourth place. James MX in fifth. Metal Jacket in sixth. Healthy Pancakes in deep, going back and forth for seventh place right now. Tiger T here in ninth place. Shark in 10th, Clapper 45 had to pull off for this race, but he will be back for the next moto. ATV Dirt Shark trying to gain some ground on these guys coming into this roller section for the sand wall. Deke, so he made a mistake in that corner going down. Dirt Shark trying to battle with him. Let's go back up front. Rocky Chop, your leader, flying into the sand section, already pulling a gap on Butter Dactyl. Parker in third, top team in fourth. James MX in fifth, putting pressure on top team for fourth place. Back to a battle going on here. Six, seventh, and eighth. Tiger T trying to catch up to Pancakes and Metal Jacket. Metal Jacket up to the inside of Pancakes. Pancakes closing the door. Up to James and Mix and top team coming down the ski jump. Butter Dactyl making his way around Parker. 
right now your top three is Rocky Chop, Mother Jackal, and Parker, 75, 74. James MX trying to get a run at top team in this section. James MX a little bit wide, just barely keeps it on the track. Same with top team. These guys going crazy in that section. Pushing it as fast as they can. Coming together there, James MX trying to go back up the inside. Top team slows up a bit to pull them off. Top team closing that inside, so James is not able to make the pass on him. James getting caught on that corner there. That is tough. That is one that's hard to take the inside. You gotta be careful or else it can catch you. Healthy Pancakes trying to hit that line as well. Not working for those guys. So James Max lost a little bit of time to top team. Not too much. Metal Jacket and Tiger T going back and forth. Tiger T catching up to these guys now. Good battle of Tiger T getting the drive through the sand section, making the pass on Metal Jacket. But Metal Jacket coming back by in the rollers. Going over that dragon's back, back into the sand. And it looks like Clapper might actually be done for the night. Hey, did anybody show up for B-Main, Smokey? going on back here between Metal Jacket and Deke. We also have a battle up front too. Butter Dactyl. Rocky Chop now back in third. He must have made a mistake. Your leader has must have gone down. My fault missed the coverage on that one. We have eight minutes to go, so plenty of time left. This top three is a tight bunch. Fourth and fifth is not too far behind. Butter Dactyl just getting the edge over Parker, but Rocky Chop with a massive drive down that straight. Carried an incredible amount of speed, able to clear over that tabletop. These guys going back and forth. Rocky Chop up the inside of Butter Dactyl. Good aggressive pass. Cuts his line off and makes it stick with Butter Dactyl. Makes the same pass back in the next corner and makes it stick. These guys both onto the inside of the sand. Rocky Chop running into the back of Butter to slow him down just a bit. So park your rear leader just ahead of these guys while these guys are going back and forth. Rocky Chop running into the tough blocks. And James MX hitting the back of him. So Rocky Chop now back in fifth. That is a really unfortunate situation there. Just battling for the lead and was up front, now back in fifth place. So now he's got some ground to make up again. This guy's not easy to get around, but this section here is pretty easy to make some passes if you get to drive. And Rocky Chop running in the top team. Those guys coming together. Oh man, this Rocky Chop looping out. It has just gone from bad to worse for him. I think I'm just going to go on to another rider because I think if I keep following him, it's not going to help. So right now, your leader is Parker7574, Butter Dactyl. The winner early in the week in the SX Replica Series. Looking to make up some ground to catch up to these guys. Healthy Pancakes now. Catching up to top team, Rocky Chop back in sixth. Now Healthy Pancakes with a mistake into the sand section. Parker's still your leader. We got a battle though between James MX and Butter Dactyl. 
Archer starting to pull away just a little bit from these guys. James and Max. That was weird. It looked like he got reset. It's Rocky Chop and Fifth trying to catch up and get as many spots as he can. He wants to get that overall. Even if third or a second. Good if you can't catch up to first, but five minutes left, anything can happen. Top team here in fourth, Rocky Chop in fifth. Back up front, Butter Dactyl in second. Trying to catch up to Parker. Parker has pulled a bit of a gap. James and Max on the back of Butter Dactyl. These guys have been battling each other so much that they're starting to lose ground. Butter Dactyl just trying to get away from James and Max. He can catch up to Parker. Butter Dactyl with a good drive over that sand wall. James and Max loses just a couple of bike lengths. Butter Dactyl now trying to put a charge down so he can catch up to the leader. Back in fourth place is top team MX, Rocky Chop in fifth. Pretty Pancakes in sixth. TTV Dirt Shark in seventh. Tiger T in eighth. Metal Jacket 91 in 9th. We got Deke 976 back here in 10th. He had a great start to the moto, but just unfortunately, some mistakes and issues happening. He's found himself back in 10th. Come on, really? Metal Jacket just sitting on the track. Parker's still your leader, Butter Dactyl in second, trying to close up on him. James MX still trailing behind him. Rocky Chop has made the pass on top team for fourth. That is one more position. And Parker going down in that rolling section. Those jumps are a challenge to get through. He makes a mistake and goes down. Butter Dactyl has Parker in his sights. He's closed in the gap, trying to get to the leader. Sandwall is tough, but it is definitely doable to get over. You just really have to seat bounce that section. James MX in third, Rocky Chop in fourth, trying to catch up to the podium. Rocky Chop getting over that wall clean. Healthy Pancakes is now up in a fifth, top team back to sixth place. Rocky Chop going down there, now back into fifth. Top team trying to catch up to him. Top team on the inside. Rocky Chop trying to stay on track. They can come together just a little bit, but Rocky Chop getting a better drive off the Dragon's back into the sand. Holds on to fifth place, so top team still back there in sixth. Healthy Pancakes is now in the fourth. James Max in third, with a better Dactyl in second. Parker up here in first. Guy's slowly catching up to him, but Parker's pulled back away just a little bit. Butter Dactyl finding a smooth line through there, tripling all the way through basically. Closing up just a little bit on Parker. James MX still keeping up there in third. Healthy Pancakes back here in fourth. Rocky Chop in fifth. Trying to catch up again. Top team running in sixth place. Your points leader right now. TTV Dirt Shark in seventh. Rocky Chop down again. Not sure in this race, you know, just not going for him. Not going well at all. Must have caught up to Pancakes, who's so trying to make the pass and get down over that roller and that jump. He 
Nice, that corner really technical for those guys. Back out front, James and Max still keeping up with Butter Dactyl, but James and Max going over the bars. So Butter Dactyl in second, Parker in first. 14 seconds left, so next lap will be the final lap. Parker trying to run this one home, but Butter Dactyl still not that far back. Parker coming through this rolling section here. Good rhythm through there. Hit it good this time. No mistakes. Just what he wanted. One of the trickier parts of the track. Better Dactyl coming through. Give a big shout out to Deep976. A little bit of a slide out there, unfortunately, in the sand, but this guy coming through in the LCQ, man, ripping a whole shot. And you may just want, don't want to stay on too much because that's how we want. And then Tiger T running back here in eighth place. This guy's got the speed, all fine straight through. a fast group of guys who can't complain even with an 8th place making it straight in. ET Beater Shark back here in 7th place with the final lap right now to try to catch back up to our leaders. Top 10 here in 6th, Rocky Chop is in 5th. Healthy Pancakes in 4th, Rocky Chop hoping maybe he can catch up to Healthy Pancakes get one more spot. James and Max is in 3rd, Butter Dactyl in 2nd, Parker in 1st, Parker about the same gap coming into this tricky section here. He's just got to hit it clean, no mistakes. Not as clean as last time, but he still kept his rhythm, didn't lose too much speed. Just missed the last triple and for the double. That was all right. Kept going, Butter Dactyl still back there in second. Healthy pancakes going for the big line out of that rhythm. Coming over the sand wall into the sand section, Parker 75. Your leader here in moto number one. Coming down the last straightaway. It's going to be Parker, 75-74, Butter Dactyl in second, James MX in third, Healthy Pancakes will be coming through in fourth, looks like Rocky Chop in fifth, we've got a battle back here with Top Team and TTV Dirt Shark, TTV Dirt Shark trying to get a drive through here, can he get a better rhythm, Top Team has a little bit of a gap, Dirt Shark trying to get the drive, Top Team holding the gap, into the final corner, Dirt Shark trying to get the drive. Just coming up a little short. Top team is gonna hold on for six. Dirt Shark back in seventh. Tiger T coming through in eighth. Deep 976 in ninth, and Metal Jacket in tenth. Great race there, your winner, Parker 75 74. Will be the fastest lap time going to Rocky Chop. I'm sure he's probably wanting that race back right about now. Just a lot of unfortunate situations and coming together with some guys and still got one more moto to go. So anything can happen in this one. Got a chance to redeem himself, get that moto win, and try to get the overall. Alright, so Clapper is in for the second moto. Just had to step out for the first one. So we will get him in here and then we will get started.
Here we go, moto number two. Some crazy racing in that first one, man. Arthur 75, 74 coming out on top with the win. It's gonna be an interesting, excuse me, interesting second moto here. These guys are on it in that race. Your fastest uh, lap time came from Rocky Chop finishing back in fifth. See if Parker can hold on and get another moto win to get that overall, or if somebody else is going to challenge him for the win. Better dactyl tie-in for the overall with uh, Rocky Chop last week, but Rocky Chop had the tiebreaker with the win in the second moto. We'll see how these results turn out in this race. See if it's the same or if it ends up being flipped around. Anything can happen with these guys. A lot of fast names. Alright, here we go. So top team MX60, Tiger T, 164, Rocky Chop, 27, Healthy Pancakes, Butter Dactyl, Deke, 976, Parker, 75, 74, Clapper, 45, 45, TTV Dirt Shark, 720, James MX81, and Metal Jacket, 91. Parker, your winner in that first moto. Butter Dactyl came through in second with James MX in third. He gripping your whole shot in the first moto. Let's see if he can do it in this one. And Butter Dactyl with the whole shot coming together with Clapper. Those guys. Their wheels kind of got together there. Parker 75, 74 back in 10th, but now up in 7th. Some guys going down right in the first corner and then into the second one. This guy's banging bars to the sand section, man. It is just chaos through there. Those guys just trying not to run into each other too much and go down just like that. Top team and deep going down. Tight racing here in the first lap. These sections really close. TTV Shark coming together with Metal Jacket. I don't think any of this is intentional. These guys really just trying to fight for a position. Just an unfortunate situation for Dirt Shark getting pushed back a bit. Top team back here making a pass on Deke. Happer just trying to get this chaos as well, getting together in that first corner. Oh, up to your leaders, Metal Jacket in 6, Healthy Pancakes in 5th, your Race 1 winner, Moto 1 winner, Parker 75, 74 in 4th, Butter Dak in 3rd, Rocky Chop in 2nd, Tiger T 164, your leader right now, great start for him, out front in Moto number 2, Rocky Chop though, getting a good drive through the sand, making the path stick, your new race leader, Rocky Chop 27, this is exactly what he wanted, get a good start and run away with it. I have a feeling that's what's going to happen in this moto, and he is almost about three seconds faster than qualifying. This dude is on it today, on another level, finding lines no one else is. Butter Dak in third, Parker in fourth. Parker would have to finish fifth or worse for Rocky Chop to get overall, but we'll see what happens to these other guys here. Top team back in ten, James MX back here as well. These guys really battling James MX. the track, I don't know. I have the reset. So James and Max had the restart glitch. It is frustrating. I do not like this game right now. This game is... Alright, this is... I did it in the LCQ, so I'm just gonna have to do it here. I am sorry, but...
Mm, it's very frustrating when I have to do that. This game is just... You need an update or something. Alright. Very frustrating difficulties. Appreciate your patience. For those racing. Started with the restart here of the second moto. Alright, so restart here. As long, I think as long as we get through the first lap line, there's no problems in the rest of the race. So that's what I'm hoping for. So Tiger T looking to get another good start in this race, heading into the first turn. He may have grabbed your whole shot though. Metal jacket in the inside of him. Butter Dackel up here as well. Rocky Chop trying to catch up in the front as well. In eighth place. Rocky Chop moving his way up to the front. James and Max up here as well with him. Parker in third. Butter Dackel and Metal Jacket. I don't want to focus on the restart too much, but. I do apologize again for that happening, but we'll focus on the race now. Just have to get that out of the way because I know it is frustrating for these guys who are racing. A little bit of contact there. Healthy Pancakes and James MX coming together. Tiger T back in ninth, man. I feel bad. You had a good lead, good start in the first photo. Your leaders Parker is now out front, Metal Jack in second. Rocky Chop and Butter Dactyl going back and forth. Rocky Chop, man, just finding the speed in that section, catching up to Butter Dactyl, almost getting by him again. He's trying to catch up to Parker, he does not want to let him get away. Terrible for Tiger T. Get a great start. James and Max out of this one. I don't know if he got reset again. I hope not, man. That's really annoying these tracks for doing this. It's just kind of got expected sometimes with technology, it seems. to your leaders, Butter Dactyl out front now, Rocky Chop in second, Parker dropping back to fourth. These guys making passes on each other, Parker trying to get back by Metal Jacket, Metal Jacket third just holding him off. Healthy Pancakes not too far behind in fifth place. Metal Jacket. Going down, it looks like. So Healthy Pancakes going by Top Team back here in six. Clapper, 45. Trying to go by Top Team, just running into the back of him. Just barely slowed him up a lot, though. Tiger T just, just 
feel bad for the guy. Had a great start in the second moto, at least in the first start of it. Butter Dackle is your leader with Rocky Chop sitting in second place. Trying to catch up to Butter. Rocky Chop getting a good drive through this section here, but both of them hitting the same lines. Chop now, getting by Butter Dactyl, getting a good drive through the sand into the wall. So new leader Rocky Chop, Parker back here in third, Healthy Pancakes in fourth, trying to catch up with these guys. A mistake from Parker in the sand, Healthy Pancakes in the third, top team is in fifth. Parker needs to stay in fourth or better to have a good shot at that overall. Though, getting some company from Metal Jacket back in sixth place. Metal Jacket staying close to these guys, not letting them get too far away. Back in seventh place, Clapper 45, 45, and eighth, TTV Dirt Shark 720. in second. These guys have a little bit of a gap, but not really too much. Over third. Top six, still pretty close. Parker in fourth, Metal Jacket. Top team going back and forth here for fifth place, but top team holding that position right now. Top team going down over the tunnel, so Metal Jacket now in the fifth. Top team trying to make the pass by him again with a bit of a good drive over the wall. Better than Metal Jacket, he's going to make the pass, but Metal Jacket trying to get by him again over the double. Metal Jacket on the outside of him. Not quite there. Metal Jacket a good drive in the sand, trying to go up the inside, and he does, but he goes off the track. Top team cuts back inside and stays on. Metal Jacket. Unfortunately, paying the price there, really trying to push the limit. TTV Dirt Shark in seventh, now caught up to the back of Metal Jack in sixth. Top team pulling away a little bit. Go back out front. Parker in fourth, Healthy Pancakes in third, Butter Dactyl in second, Rocky Chop in first. First moto, it went like this, but he's doing what he can now and out front, leading this race. Butter Dackle in second, Healthy Pancakes in third, Parker in fourth. Top team a little bit back in fifth, trying to catch up to these guys, see if he can make some moves. Parker finishes fifth, I think that might give Rocky Chop the overall, but should take a look and make sure. Butter Dackle got a second in. Moto 1. Which it would actually 2-2 two, two would probably definitely be the 5 one five, no doubt. So better Dactyl right now. We need Parker to finish fifth to get that overall. Sixty-four point 
Sputter Tactical 66. Parker has 65 points. So Butter Dactyl just at the overall edge right now. One point. So Parker needs to get up to third if he wants that overall, or else Butter Dactyl can't get it with 2 2. So healthy Pancakes in third trying to hold on to that spot. We're just about halfway through here. 10 minutes left in this race. Rocky Chop starting to pull away a little bit from Butter Dactyl. Let's go back though. Got some more coverage of these guys back here. Top team running in fifth. TTP Dirt Shark in sixth, just behind him. Metal Jacket in seventh. Tiger T in eighth. Tiger T just hoping for these guys to make a mistake so he can catch up to the back of them. on the back of Metal Jacket. You can see the numbering on his jersey. Read that name. He knows he's close. Metal Jacket with a mistake. Tiger T. One of the easiest passes I'm sure he's had to make in this race. Going right by him. Metal Jacket making a mistake after that tunnel. Metal Jacket a little bit better of a drive over that sand wall. Metal Jacket trying to go up the inside. Tiger T just holding him off. Metal Jacket just clearing over that double. Really had a seat bounce that to get over it. Metal Jacket just landing on the side of Tiger T there. Tiger T checking up a little bit on the sand wall. Metal Jacket just sending it off there. TTB Dirt Shark and Top Team battling. Got battles all over the track. You can see fourth and third going back and forth right now. We are going to have to check in on them pretty soon. Tiger T holding off Metal Jacket back here. There, Metal Jacket kind of pushing into the back of Tiger T. Let's go up to Parker and Healthy Pancakes. Parker catching up to Healthy Pancakes. Parker getting a good drive through that section. Pancakes trying to recover, losing his rhythm. Parker up to the inside. And he makes the pass, but Healthy Pancakes back to the inside, trying to go by him. These guys are teammates though, not getting too aggressive, trying to be easy on each other. Parker making the pass. Healthy Pancakes in fourth, so now Parker sitting in the overall position now. So put him one point ahead of Butter Dactyl. Butter Dactyl would have to catch Rocky Chop in order to get that overall win, but Rocky Chop, man, he's flying, he's pulling a gap. Let's go back here. Metal Jack and Tiger T going back and forth. Tiger T now back past him. Top team and TTV Dirt Shark having a battle as well. These guys throwing some whips over that double. Top team trying to air it out. And I don't know if that was incidental. Yeah, that looked incidental, but just kind of a warning. You just got to watch those. Obviously, you can send them all, but just be careful not trying to send it right to the middle. It makes it difficult for those guys. Metal Jacket in 7th, Tiger T in 8th. These guys battling each other hard, going back and forth. Tiger T trying to come up the inside of Metal Jacket. He's going to make the pass. Obviously, a bit aggressive. Metal Jacket aggressive in the pass. Last lap here. Tiger T hugging that inside so Metal Jacket cannot make the pass in that same corner. Let's go back up front. Parker trying to catch up to Pancakes. Pancakes pulling the lead back out a little bit ahead of Parker. Top team here in fifth. TTV Dirt Shark in sixth. Metal Jacket and Tiger T going back and forth. That battle is all over the track right now. Lapper back here in ninth, trying to catch up to these guys. These guys are going to be battling so much, they'll want to eventually catch up and be a three-way battle. Deke back here in tenth. Solid race from him, first time in the National Series, making it into the A main, so well done for him. On board the Jimmy John's KTM. Race leader right now, Rocky Chop, heading through the finish line. Second place, Butter Dactyl, all the way back at the beginning of that long straight. Quite the gap that Rocky Chop has really putting the laps in. Healthy Pancakes in third, but Parker just behind him in fourth. 
top team in fifth place. A little bit of a gap over Dirt Shark now. So these guys not as close as they were. Metal Jacket now ahead of these guys. Clapper has made his way past Tiger T. Tiger T is just battling for seventh. Metal Jacket and some mistakes. And a little bit of rough riding between the two. Tiger T now back in ninth. Tiger T sending it in there. Yeah, these guys are just sending it so close in there, trying to do everything they can. Big send though by Tiger T into that sand section. So back up front, Metal Jack in seventh, TT Dirt Shark in sixth. Top team is in fifth. Healthy Pancakes now back in fourth place. Parker in third now, looking at your overall spot. Guess where they were last time. Just hard to keep track with so many battles going on. Who's where? Parker in third is your overall winner right now as they sit. Butter Dactyl with 2 2 scores with the second overall. I'd like to say that Rocky Chop would be third with the 5-1. It's James and Max out of this one. Fortunate in technical difficulties with the track. Let's go back to the battle on the track right now. Looks like it's Clapper 45-45 and Tiger T 164. Clapper 45 just ahead of Tiger T. Tiger T trying to make up some ground. I hate to say it, but sometimes the commentator's curse is just too real. <laughs> Try to give him coverage and then off on the sand wall, but again, 20 minute race. Second moto, man, these guys are probably tired, I'm sure. Focus, trying to put in these clean laps. Top team in fifth, just ahead of TTV Dirt Shark. I think it's a good run here in fourth place. Parker in third. Catching up to Butter Dactyl a little bit. Rocky Chop. And Deke must know. Thank you, Deke. Deke pulling out of the way perfectly there for Rocky Chop. Dactyl here in second, Parker in third. We got a battle here. Now, if Butter Dactyl goes 2 3, that would be 64 points. And Rocky Chop at the 5 1 will get 64 as well. So, Butter Dactyl needs to stay in second to get second overall. If not, Rocky Chop will get bumped up. So, Parker. Closing up on Butter Dactyl. Makes that pass. They'll bump Butter Dactyl down in overall position. Rocky Chop absolutely on fire. I give him credit. Just unfortunate first moto. Only managed the fifth. Just a lot of unfortunate situations and mistakes that happen. But Definitely putting on a dominant performance in this race. Let's go back. We have some battles going on. Tiger T and Clapper. Let's see them going back and forth with TT Dirt Shark and Top Team. TT Dirt Shark on the inside of Top Team making a pass. Top Team trying to go back on the inside. Then we got a battle going on up front. Second and third. Parker catching up to Butter Dactyl. Parker really finding some good lines, closing up to Butter Dactyl, making the pass, but Butter Dactyl smooth onto the inside, hitting that section and almost perfectly. Parker just casing the jump a little. Butter Dactyl able to get by him. Some great racing between these guys. Butter Dactyl trying to hold on to second overall. He needs that second place spot to get second overall, or else Rocky Chop will take you from him. Rocky Chop right now, third overall. Parker really pressuring Butter Dactyl. Healthy Pancakes back here in fourth. TTV Dirt Shark and Top Team battling. 
And we got Tiger T and Clapper 45, 45 battling with each other. These guys having some good, clean battles. Do you like to see these guys not getting aggressive with each other, just having a lot of fun? Parker, not as close this time. Butter Jackal pull away just a little bit. Healthy Pancakes, really not too far away either. He's kept up with him. T2 Dirt Strike in fifth. Top team here in sixth. Metal Jacket all by himself now in seventh. But Tiger T and Clapper, and these guys went back and forth. This is for eighth place, and these guys still giving it their all. Oh, Tiger T sliding out, but Clapper. Going over or off the track or something. Oh. Alright, this is guys really like battling with each other. Tiger T waiting out to race the clapper. Rocky Chop though, making his way past them. Go back up to second and third, Butter Dactyl and Parker. Healthy Pancakes running in fourth, good gap over TTV Dirt Shark, top team here in sixth. Parker in third, trying to catch up to Butter Dactyl. Making his way through the finish line, so it is now the final lap. Rocky Chop, your leader. Better Dactyl here in second. Parker running in third. So close to Better Dactyl. Parker still has the overall win right now. Trying to get as many points as possible. Healthy Pancakes closing up a little bit on these guys. It's the final lap. Let's see if we can make up any more ground. T3 Air Shark in fifth. Top team here in sixth. Metal Jacket in seventh. Clapper in eighth. Battling with Tiger T. Deke 976. Not too far back from these guys. And then maybe these guys will battle even more and you can catch up to the back of them. Rocky Chop though looking solid on the Jimmy Jones KTM number nine. Dackle and Parker going down. I don't these guys battling with each other. I know they are teammates, so probably not trying to take each other out, but both going down in that section. Healthy pancakes catching up to him. Your winner is Rocky Chop in Moto 1. So Butter Dactyl in second, Parker in third. Parker trying to make the pass on him. Butter Dactyl just needs to hold him off to the finish. We've got about 30 seconds left. I think they will make it to the finish, but we'll see. Still a fight, gotta stay in front of each other. Butter Dactyl over the double. Parker, healthy pancakes. Parker trying to send that sand wall, trying to get as much speed as he can. Butter Dactyl with a mistake. Parker making the pass. Can Butter Dactyl get the drive? Here he goes. Butter Dactyl on the left side trying to make the pass. Running out of time. Parker is just gonna hold off and get second from Butter Dactyl in the last corner. That'll bump uh, Butter Dactyl back to third. Rocky Chop in the second overall. Might have to look at the math again. I don't want to be saying too much to tell you the points, but. There you have it. Rocky Chop, your winner in moto number two. Parker 75, 74 in second. Butter Dactyl in third. What a race. Your overall winner is going to be Parker 75 74. Some great racing by these guys here. Parker, your winner of that mystery box from Forever Grips Gaming. And 
And I do want to say with that performance though, top team finishing 6-6. Let me see how many points that'll give him. That'll give him 54 points. With that, that puts him at 616. Max Miles not racing today. It's only one race left. That'll make Top Team MX6 the year champion for Season 1 of the MX National Series. Congratulations to him. Long season for these guys, but he stuck it out and rode every single race. The consistency paid off for him. So congratulations to Top Team MX60. Your championship winner here for Season 1. Great racing by these guys. We got the last round, round 12, next week. Same time, Friday, 8 p.m. Eastern. Season 2 coming up soon. Just after that, we got some prizes coming to you guys. Some autograph gear from Brett Q. And some more prizes on the way. You guys do not want to miss out on these for Season 2. Thank you guys for tuning in, and we will catch